morning, everybody. We're here in Floyd, Iowa. We gotta go down to Burlington, Iowa. Grab a load of tires. We're gonna pull that all the way up to Saskatchewan. It's a beautiful day out. It's gonna be a good one. I'm in this guy's way. I'm that guy walking right through the middle of the parking lot. <laughs> Sorry. Oh yeah, there you go. Song of my people. hilarious you know that truck that I was blocking by walking across the parking lot <laughs> his name's Max he follows my vlogs he came and said hi <laughs> well shout out to Max that's all it's all it's cool all the people that we meet on the road I was saying yesterday that uh, you know this this grass area here I think they used to keep this mowed down because I used to stop here and we used to let diesel run around here all the time uh, I really like this stop. Yeah. He was saying too that they got our great food inside as well. Uh, he's from the area here. So I got to apologize to him for being that guy who's just, you know, off in his own world, walking right through the middle of the parking lot, blocking traffic. <laughs> Usually I'd be uh, a little bit more aware uh, hadn't had my coffee yet. I just woke up. I was wandering in. I thought he was gonna go behind me and go out the exit there, right? So and then he stopped. I was like, oh shoot, I'm in his way. I hate being in people's way. That's because I know how it feels. I know how it feels having someone in your way and not paying attention. You're like, hey, come on. I'm here. You see me? <laughs> That's why I gotta remember when I'm getting frustrated with people. I have to remember sometimes it's me. Sometimes it's me in that position frustrating other people, so. Gotta cut people some slack sometime, I think. It's gonna be a good day today. I'm glad you guys are here. Uh, sit down, buckle up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We make new videos every day while we're on the road. It's gonna be fun. Got a scale here, wants to take a little closer look at us. I got the light to come on in. I guess it makes 
sense. <laughs> For some reason, I always thought they were slow. I don't think the highway speed. Just driving past the Quaker Oats plant. Still got about an hour and a half. They are expecting us there. We're going to arrive about an hour to a half hour early, but they're already all ready for me there, so I can just pull right in. They'll get me loaded just after lunch. And we'll tire down. And we'll head over to that Highway 34 truck stop where we slept, uh, what was it, last week or whatever? That's that place I always stay at there. Probably grab a coffee from them or stretch my legs a little bit, maybe have some lunch. You don't see that car right beside you, bud? Oh, you're on your phone. Put your phone down, man. He's got his phone to his head. He's a new shock on that front wheel, too, man. That tire's just bouncing along. Yikes. Pay attention to what you're doing, bud. You won't run into people. been good. Let's hope that it stays that way. You know, it's been a really mild fall season. I really hope that continues through the winter. We already had a really nice winter last year because of the El Nino. But uh, they say it's supposed to be the opposite this year. Well, what do they know? I don't know. No one knows. I'd prefer never to feel minus 40 degree weather again. But uh, I guess we'll see what happens. Why are you all on the road right now? I was gonna get through here without you noticing me. 
I was just saying they're gonna be able to tell that I'm not a big city boy like just talking to me for five seconds like oh this guy's not from here no no I, I, I am uh, I'm not a big city guy continue on this road for seven kilometers look at that traffic there to the left that's where we want to get onto no way no way maybe I should have gone up through I-35 all the way up to 694 on the north side turn right and then turn left in 40 meters Karen you don't know what you're talking about there's construction quiet I don't even know what I'm talking about okay we're just following the cars in front of us we're just following the lane oh and we gotta yield into this oh I gotta merge into this mess uh surprise a big semi merging in everybody's Continue gonna be so happy this road for six kilometers wait is there two lanes here or do I gotta merge no we gotta merge oh man Oh, nobody's gonna want to let the big semi in. Everybody's already frustrated. They've been waiting in line. Oh, no way. Someone's gonna let me in right away? No, I don't believe it. No, I didn't think so. I didn't think so. He stepped on the, he stepped on the gas. Ha, <laughs> ha. That little, I'll give him the thank you. There was a, a pickup truck that let me in after that. Ha, <laughs> ha, ha. This little white car tricked me, made it look like he was gonna let me in. And right at the last second when I was about to stick my nose in there, you could see his, his headlights lift up a little bit as the front of his car lifted when he hit the gas. He suddenly realized, wait, 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 I don't wanna be behind the big truck. But look at this, Minneapolis is smart in this aspect. Like, they do their construction at night. That, that is smart. Winnipeg, the construction workers, they only work from about, uh, I think they only work from about like 9 a.m. to 9.30. And for the rest of the time, they just stand around until like four o'clock sharp and they're gone. <laughs>
dare you? How dare you? That's where I like to park. There's lots of other good spots here though. We'll, we'll find something. He's a Canuck too. Us Canucks gotta look out for each other, eh? Well, you can have my spot, fine. Fine. I'll forgive you this time. Just because you got Alberta plates. Everybody gets one. Where am I going to move? See, this guy took up two spots and he doesn't even have a sleeper. What are you doing there, bud? What are you doing? Oh, there's a cat. Look at that. There'll be a spot. Oh, yeah, there's lots of spots in the back over there. Oh, yeah. I'll find some. And we made it. I had nine minutes left on my clock when I parked it. Cut it a little close. Oh, wow, look at that sleeper over there on that truck. Noise. Here we are. I don't know why no one else was parked here except these dump trucks. But these dump trucks were parked here and there was a space in the middle here. So I took it. There's no sign saying I couldn't, so I took it. Another, uh, I was gonna park in here, but I didn't want to block that guy in. So there we go. All ready to take off from here in the morning. The tires on the back here. Be about a full day drive. Uh, I think I got uh, another 12 hours of driving left that I can do tomorrow. I can get to the Canadian border in about 10 hours. And uh, another couple hours from there and we'll be at our destination. I guess I could have probably blocked that guy in. It doesn't look like he's going anywhere. Oh well. I didn't want to knock on my door first thing in the morning telling me to move. I'd rather just sleep till I have to go. It's gonna be a long day. I'm gonna need my rest. Today was, hmm, was a pretty long day. I think you know, we drove our full 11 hours today. Not a lot done, got a lot of distance behind us. As you can tell from the vlogs, it was just go, 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 drive, drive, drive. You're finally getting to see my face. I apologize. You thought you were gonna get through a whole video and not have to look at this thing. Surprise. <sighs> I've already wasted an hour of my 10. I'm gonna be parked here for 10 hours. Sat here for an hour swiping through Instagram Reels, Facebook, a TikTok. I was on YouTube for a while. Oh, it just sucks you in. Like, you got to be careful with these phones, right? And when I say you, I mean me. Like, they're, it's addictive. It's dangerously addictive. You know the people who make these things, they know how addictive they are. It's... You ever get that where you're like, it just sucks you in, right? And you don't even notice anything going on around you. And suddenly you're like... <laughs> You look around and you look at the clock and you've been staring at your phone for like an hour. Just an hour of your life, gone. You can't even remember what you were all looking at. It just, it just sucks you in. Whew, gotta be careful with that. But I don't get a lot of time to do that, right? Because obviously I'm not doing that during the day when I'm working and on the road. So when I finally stop at the end of my day, it's my time to kind of like unwind, catch up with social media. That's why I don't get back to a lot of you when you comment uh like facebook private messages uh very often i don't even check those i have been recently since the diesel video because a lot of you have been leaving very nice uh comments and messages in there i've been reading them but uh you know i try to respond to a couple but if i were to respond uh, to all the comments uh sometimes it would take what little time i have at the end of my day and uh Sometimes I just want to uh, relax and unwind. Maybe watch a Netflix video or edit videos or something. So please don't take it personally if I don't respond to your comment. I, I do try to read them all. YouTube comments, I read them all. 
uh, Instagram, Facebook, anywhere else, private DMs or messages. I don't always get to them. Uh, I'm just, I'm busy working out here. Guys, I'm not ignoring you at all. I apologize if it seems that way. It's not my intent. Oh, shoot, I gotta, why am I taking my jacket off? I gotta bring my garbage to the garbage bin yet. So we started in Floyd, Iowa this morning, drove down to Burlington, got these tires loaded and tied down, and pretty much drove straight up here. We're past Minneapolis, so that's good. Whew. There's no big cities left to go through. The biggest city we have left to go through is Fargo, North Dakota, or Minot, North Dakota, maybe. We'll grab some fuel tomorrow. I was still at just below half tank. We've been doing pretty good for fuel economy on this trip. I've been happy with that. I'll check fuel prices in the morning, uh, see where the best place is to go, and we'll go from there. But thanks for uh, hanging out with me on this mostly driving day. I hope you enjoy the, the view out my windshield. That's the same view I stared at all day too, so at least I'm not the only one, right? Not always as much to show you when I'm here on the plains. But I'll see you guys tomorrow, right? Hit that thumbs up button if you guys like my videos. It helps me a lot. Leave me a comment down below. If you want to take it one step further, you can become a member down below. Click the join now button. It'll explain to you how for like the price of a coffee uh, a month, you can get early access to my videos if that's what you would like to do. You also get special status in the comment section. But if that's not for you, that's totally cool. I understand. Leave me a comment down below. And the best thing you can do to subscribe, to subscribe is support. I'm tired. I'm just gonna leave it just like that. I'm not even gonna edit it. Usually I'd go back and edit that out and redo it. I'm just gonna, you know what I meant. You guys watch YouTube. You're on YouTube all the time. You know exactly what I was gonna say. You've probably clicked off the video already anyways because the it's the same spiel at the end of every YouTuber's video. The best thing you can do to support me is subscribe. It's free and hit that bell so you don't miss my, so you don't miss my videos. I really gotta get to bed. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Uh, we'll be headed into North Dakota and then Saskatchewan.